Hi and welcome to my channel. In this video I will show you Leonardo Eyes, Canva, tool, capable of amplifying the work of image generation with the use of adding portions to the sides or directly inside the generated representations or imported. To access the tool just click on the button in the left menu. It is immediately noticeable that Leonardo I warns us of the beta message, which means that, as of the date I am recording this video, Canva is still in the development and implementation phase. Anyway, from my first experiments to today, the use of the tools has given me excellent results. Click on the button and you will be taken to the Canva interface. Let's take a look at Leonardo I's Canvas tool commands. In the left menu, we try the pan command. An icon in the shape of a hand, it is used to move and navigate within the workspace. The Select tool allows us to select the generation frame or the image we are working on. Snap is a very useful command that allows you to snap the side or corner of the frame to the image. The Mask helps us preserve portions of images from generation. The Delete tool deletes portions of badly generated or undeveloped images, or deletes only the masks. The Import command, load an image, optionally from our computer, from personal works drawing from the personal feed area or from community works. Below we find the command to export the image to the PC in PNG format, and the commands to cancel or recall an operation. On the right side is the Job Setting menu. At the top are the controls for increasing and decreasing the view. Below the credit quantity is the model selection submenu, a choice between the 1.5 and 2.1 versions of stable diffusion. Subsequently, the submenus for number of images to be generated up to 4. Image dimension setting with preset formats, selectable size adjustment controls and aspect ratio. Finally, the tiling switch for the pattern image option. The reset of the settings to the default situation. At the bottom and middle of the interface is the prompt to enter the generation text and the negative prompt. I start with one work, an oriental and wooded environment with cherry blossoms and Buddha statues.
Now I try to make additions to an image taken from previous generations. I choose the image, and from the three dots menu I select the Edit in Canvas Import Item.